I could give or take the turkey. Even when I make it at Christmas. I just think it's dry. I do not make the turkey dry, cheeky pants. Cheers. Cheese. Cheese. You say nugget or nougat? Mmm. I like that. I like love. I feel like Costa muffins are great. Oh. Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome back to another video. Today's video is actually one of my absolute favourites to film. Um, I couldn't really film it last year either because it is the Costa Christmas menu and they didn't bring out any new drinks last year which is really disappointing but this year they have so i'm gonna try them all i'm with my mum we have came to the same um costa drive through that we'll come to every year for like a little tradition i say every year we did it the first year which was so fun and we've been and tried a summer menu we're trying to work out what it was but we're here we've got all the goods and we're gonna try them so let's get on with it what? so i was thinking the um toblerone muffin yes and then we'll get another Christmas tree, some either something else you pick. Uh, chocolate muffin inspired by Toby or Christmas tree sh or Christmas tree shortcake. Where is that? Okay, right down. Yeah. Right. Do you want to shout that? Hi, we're ready. Can you go ahead? Yes, please. Yes. Yeah. And a Terry's chocolate orange hot chocolate, please. Yeah, is that small too? Yes, please. Yeah. Then can we get the brie and bacon panini? Um, yes. Please. Oh, yeah. Actually, no, the, right one? the brie and cranberry toasty one, please. Instead. Oh, I was just going to say, yeah. The, yeah, the it's, the, it's just brie and cranberry, yeah? Yeah. Anything else? And then the turkey and toast, uh, turkey and trimmings toasty, please. Yeah. And then the chocolate muffin and spaghetti. Yeah, with Toblerone. the Toblerone muffin. Toblerone muffin, yeah? Yeah. And the Christmas tree shortcake, please. Sorry, what was that last one? Christmas tree shortcake, oh, please. Yeah. No worries. Thank you. Everything? Yeah, yeah, thank you. Well, subscribe down, thanks. 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 Okay, let's try this for the very first <laughs> so, time. So, Mum's actually really annoyed me and tried a drink already, which is the hot chocolate. Toblerone. Toblerone hot chocolate. How could I annoy you? <laughs> Easy, you just did. I've been the drink. I needed now. it. For the second time, <laughs> it's gorgeous. <laughs> She's so <laughs> annoying. I was like, literally, can we just wait? And she couldn't. Anyway, this is the Toblerone hot chocolate. So that's like the new addition this year. Toblerone um, latte and Toblerone hot chocolate. So let's have a try. You also get a little... Melted. I know the murder on the but Toblerone so. on top, but my advice would be take it off the top as soon as you get it because it actually melts. I just thought you've got no taste. At least I can I taste, can't taste it. it. A bit. It's funny, isn't it? I could taste all of the Raj last night. Really? I don't know. This is the latte. I which, definitely like that one. So you're a hot chocolate and this is perfect because I'm a latte. Do you want to try that I'll first try that and I'll here, drink that? Because I probably won't like this because it won't be strong. Yeah, it won't be strong. Yeah. It's like Ovaltine. What's that? A malty drink. That doesn't taste like coffee to me and I can barely taste the Toblerone. Oh, that just tastes taste. strong of coffee. Really? In my taste. I did have COVID last Christmas and I've lost my taste and smell but i know if something's like nice if that makes sense it's really weird um this does taste good but it's quite strong coffee i would say i didn't think it was you don't obviously think? i drink strong coffee so that's not strong enough hmm. Hmm. i think the hot chocolate was nicer another little drink. let's have a little bit of the toblerone off the top i'll have half you also this is breaking my diet today i'm sweet before we'll have a sandwich yeah i know that look terrible. Mm -hmm. I actually love Toblerone. Have that bit then. No, you. I don't love it. Then there's any more. Eat it. I don't love it. Honestly. I don't love it. Who is the mother? Not you. Right. I so, think like Chloe Kardashian. She says I'm bossy. 
is. And then we also got a staple. Oh, that's melted too. That They're is all so hot. annoying. <laughs> the Terry's Chocolate Orange Hot Chocolate, which is an, a firm favourite. And obviously this must be popular because this was three Christmases ago. Mm -hmm. No, two Christmases ago and last year and this year. I think I'm gonna love this. I feel like that's just delicious, but I've had that before and I love that. I also have actually had a Christmas drink already, but it was actually from Starbucks and I got the gingerbread ice latte, which was really nice. Oh, it's so nice. It is so it? nice. Terry's chocolate orange. Where do you prefer your coffee from? Because I used to always think Costa. I think I still do, but Starbucks is a bit stronger. So who knows? Let's go for Let this. me know. We've got some Sarnies sandwiches. Sarnies. Sandra. Sarnies. What did we get again? Oh, this is all the trimmings. Brie and cranberry which and is not turkey this. trimmings. So this is the turkey trimmings. I actually am not crazy on turkey. Like I would, I could give or take the turkey. You know what I make at Christmas? I just think it's dry. I do not make the turkey dry, cheeky pants. Right, here we go. Obviously I'm not a good chef, but. It looks a bit suspect. Go on, you taste it first. It's got a pig's in blanket oh, in the middle. <laughs> bit of bacon. Has it? Oh my god, it's all falling apart. Oh, what the heck? I could have done with some serviettes, but I don't have I'll keep it. it. So this is the sandwich. My sandwich. It's a good job we've got the same germs. It's not actually hot. I think it's got stuffing in. Oh no. Do you not like it? Oh, actually, that's nice. You're so dramatic. <laughs> Mum, I feel like you're not actually in the shot too much. That's because you're hogging there. the camera. Hogging. Well. Mm, it's actually delicious, that. This is the brie and cranberry, is it? Mm -hmm. I actually love cheese. I love cheese that much, so I know I love this. Mum doesn't actually like cheese like too cheese. much. Cheers. Cheese. Cheese to the cheese. Mm. Mm -mm. I'm just happy to be eating. This is delicious. The girl at Starbucks said that she loved the what drink? Oh, it was the panini. It was this, yeah. That one. Oh, mine. The turkey and trimmings. Mm. Had you seen us coming round? You knew what we were doing? No, she just asked us what we were getting all the Christmas menu. Mm-hmm. Is that a sausage in there? Oh my god, yeah. Bite it. It's tasty. <laughs> to me, this is delicious because I can taste the brie. And I can also taste the... Tr it's kind of like sweet and savoury in a sandwich, isn't it? Because mm -hmm. the cheese is like savoury and then the brie is like sweet. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How many calories is in that? Today, calories don't count. Okay, Miss Half a Grapefruit. This is so delish. Mm. Mag Magpie. Blue in front of us. I've seen a lot of one magpies recently. Mm. That's not good. Yeah, I know. Um, so, this year, I'm actually changing up my Christmas tree theme. And I actually have got some wipes in my bag. It's okay. He just interrupted us. Honestly, she's getting sacked from this vlogging. Well, you told us to be natural. <laughs> That's what I do, natural. Interrupt. No. Um, well, did you want me to get them? No, because they'll laugh. Why? It's toilet roll. <laughs> You've got napkins, bog roll. Where is it in your bag? Yeah. I probably have got some tissues in the bottom. Oh, there we go. Nice napkins, bog roll. There you go, dolls. Um, yeah, so I'm changing up my Christmas tree theme. And my fiancé, who is called Jake, I don't know if you've watched these vlogs, you'll know him. If not, you won't know him. But basically, he is not that Christmassy. He's quite Scrooge vibes. And I had to tell him that I didn't like our old Christmas tree because I was trying to make a point for getting a new Christmas tree. When in fact, I just want to get another tree because I want to put up two. And 
my theme for my new tree which i'm manifesting because i don't have it yet is going to be multicolored because as like a child growing up my mum always had a theme which was always what was your theme it was always the same new white, white fluffy white fluffy <laughs> crystals yeah like basically like posh and I just said that I really wanted to do like a multicolored, I've always wanted a multicolored tree. I would always buy random baubles, wouldn't I? Mm -hmm. And try and stick them on my mum's tree. We always did it and I used to hide them at the back. Yeah. This is the um, Terry's chocolate hot chocolate, by the way. So good. Nice. Oh, is that yours? Right, okay, I'll have the other one. This woman to, your, uh, get your cranberry fingers out my and hair. I, have... I want you to try mine. Well, what's the point? I don't like it, so I'll slag it off. Well, that's fine. If it's just different people like different things. Go on. Oh, um, so yeah, I've got, I've gone for multicolored, and I've been buying loads of baubles recently, and um, can't wait to actually put the tree up, which is going to be the first of December. I think I'm going to be doing weekly vlogmas again, just like vlogs, and I'll try and upload a lot more in December of like festive things. I would absolutely love a Chris, a real Christmas tree, but I just feel like value for money to buy a new gorgeous, maybe like seven foot one that I can use every year. But the smell of the tree. I know, but then I can just get loads of like sticks to make, you know what they're called, like incense sticks to make the smell yeah. feel real. That's nice. Well, but you prefer not yours. as nice as um, that one. I've got to Go be honest, I actually think the Terry's chocolate orange is the best drink still. I'm not really loving them too. Toblerones. I like the Toblerone on top. I don't know. I'm Why just not sure. Share it? That's the wrong one. That's the Terry's one. Is that? Yeah. Glad you told us because I would have been drinking the rubbish one. Um, do you think you were deprived as a child? Definitely. Because we had a posh tree. Yeah. Definitely. But you had a multicoloured one growing up or not? Yes. So that was why I wanted a themed one. Mm. Mm. And I also love a real tree because Grandma wouldn't let. You had have a, one. We did have a real tree once. And she bought it from my brother-in-law who had a shop at the time. And he said, it's been dipped, it won't drop. I'm not joking. A couple of days in the house what, was and it the dead? whole pines dropped off. You know how we get like a sprinkling mm -hmm. under our tree? This tree just completely Does that mean it's dying? Was, it was dead and it wasn't obviously dipped in the chemical that it's meant to be dipped in to oh, stop no. it from dropping. But our Nordman never dropped it. Up. Nordman's a type of tree if you're not clued up. The Christmas tree. If you're not Mrs. Christmas tree over there. We're just moving because the light went rubbish and we'll have some desserts to try. So it needs to be great lighting for the dessert. Do we have a dessert wine mm. to go with our dessert? This has got like a nutty almost Well, taste. yeah, Toblerone's got that like nice uh, nugget, isn't it? Nougat. Do you say nugget or nougat? You're driving me crazy. Your driving is driving me insane. I think I'm doing well. Keep going. Well, whatever. Is it better? Obviously, you haven't yeah, got the light fine. on me very well. You don't want me to be on this. Because the sun is just creeping through. I know the light looks crap on you. I'm not bothered. Well, you'll only slag me off. If I'm not on it fully and looking. There you are. My very, very Maybe best. you're too far forward. Back. Really? <sighs> there we go. So... Not really gonna lie, I'm not really obsessed with the Toblerone drink. It was nice though. Would you order it again? No, I think I'd get the I'd Terry's. Order this as well. For dessert, I know Mum's not onto that yet, but we've got it's okay. a short Christmas tree shortbread. Let's try it though. And then a Toblerone muffin, which I know this will be. Hot diggity damn. I think we'll be fighting over. Are it. you gonna finish with sandwich or not? Are you turning that off or are you just throwing mm. away? You're so we'll just quiet. Chat. Quiet, eat it. Just trying all the drinks. It is frustrating that the drink, the little chocolates melt. Excuse me. But. If there's any more Christmas menus that you want me to try, just let me know. I feel like the Starbucks one is okay. We could maybe try that. 
McDonald's, I like to try that. I tried that a couple of years ago. I didn't try that last year, I don't think, but maybe I could try that, which will be fun. But this is like a little tradition for me and mum to try the Costa menus together because Christmas has started. Christmas is here. It is this it's December. It is November the 4th. Christmas has arrived. We've even got Christmas songs on in the car, but obviously I don't want to get copyrighted, so we're just gonna listen to them when we leave. This is super strong, I think. Don't drink it then. Babes, I'll drink it. Greedy guts. Are we going for gummies? <laughs> Chloe? Mum was watching the Kardashians last night and they went for like gummies. And it was, uh, it's like cannabis weed, oil, cannabis oil. oil. She wants to go for one. Chris Kardashian was crazy after half a one. I'm definitely not going to drink the latte. It's not hitting the spot. Really? Yeah, look at it. Mm. Looks sad. Mm -hmm. I just took the lid off and it looks really poor. Maybe I should have got an iced one. Mum's got bacon hanging out of her mouth. Such a lady. There actually was other, like, vegan options and more Christmas options, but... Oh, look how melted that is. Are you going to bother with it? Yeah, I'm actually not. Um, but we just kind of went for these bits, these three drinks, two sandwich sandwiches and then two desserts. So let's just let Mrs. Turkey Trimmins finish her sarnie. People are staring at us for vlogging. I'm not in the beer. Oh, is that what it is? Mm -hmm. well, maybe it's not the camera. Maybe it's because the fact we parked over two beers. Mm. But like forward and back. I'm leave that bit. Why? It's got a big bit of sausage in it. You're not feeling it. Mm -mm. You're not feeling the sauce. I only like certain sausages. Okay, dirty dirty. So this biscuit, you want to try? Absolutely. I'm not really a massive shortbread lover. Then why did you let me get it? Because you are, you wanted this as your option and I said the muff muff. You're not even on the camera. Well, that's just like a normal shortbread biscuit with a bit icing on the top. That looks like a treat. It's actually tasteless, isn't it? Mm. Mm. Dust. Now those sweets, they are... They're not sweets? They are. They've got like a taste of... Sorry, they're not the icing, but the taste of something. Oh, what is it again? Play-Doh. Similar. <laughs> Dust. That's actually not very nice, is it? Pointless. Mm-hmm. You'd be really disappointed if you were wanting a nice sweet treat with that. Because it... Even shortbread though, you can get like gorgeous shortbread from m &S. With chocolate on. Really? No. I was thinking I've never seen that. Do you need to go anywhere after here? Mm. No, I really need to go. I'll do. Guess again. m &S. I'm not eating that, it's got a horrible taste. Costco. What we do you need, need at Costco? Bog roll. I can give you four. Well, I can go to the shop and buy four, but I like to just get it from there. Would you not go through the night? No. Right, it's muff muff time. Oh, it's got like... You should have said to him, if you don't come to Costco with us, I'm filling the phone in for the <laughs> Oh, so Where's it got the good? How do you eat this? You think you just like get your mouth around it? Yeah. Do that and give it a squidge or oh, not, nah, on you. I don't want to get dirty. Don't get bits in my car. Right. Oh, oh it's got car caramel in the middle. That looks moist. Delicious, moist muff. Oh, I thought that was my bit. No, this is my bit. I like the crispy on the top of the um, muff. Mm. How do you do that? Because Costa do a good muff. For me. So good. Why are you closing your eyes? 
just to enjoy the experience more. Mmm. I like that. I got love. I feel like Costa muffins are great. Aren't they? They used to do it, um, no, I'm gonna lie, I was gonna mention it in other places. Where? They used to do an orange, raspberry and something. No, it was an that raspberry and white chalk? With orange in as well, it was so lovely. That's delicious, isn't it? Totally. How do you, should I just eat that top bit? Yeah, just eat it. Do you know what my gooey bit? You can have that. Will you eat it? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So my favourite thing was, was the sandwich. Really? The hot chocolate. Cherry's orange and then this. So basically nothing really from this year's quick oh shit. Well the sandwich and the muffin I guess. Was the turkey and trimmings off last year? I don't know. But my girl actually said that was good, didn't she? Mm-hmm. The only thing I tried last year was toffee penny latte and a hot chalk. And the millionaire short bread slice which was delicious and that's actually on the menu again mm. maybe that is what I really wanted that's what I think you were meaning that shortbread I feel like going around and throwing it back in the window <laughs> I swear she's not violent that was pathetic the short why did we get that because I think you were thinking it was millionaires yeah because that was underneath wasn't it mm-hmm Hmm, that muffin, I guess, would be really sickly if you actually ate the whole thing. Of because course it wouldn't, it's gone now. No, it? but my bit, I had all the chocolate and then the Toblerone. Sickly. In terms of calories, I will not be putting that in calorie counting for the day because... Well, I've been in the gym, so technically, I'm good. What are we rating this year's Christmas overall? Seven. I'd probably say a seven. I think the food was better than the drinks, definitely. Do you think? Mm -hmm. Mum's just licking her chocolate fingers, hiding. I'll just call you out when you're trying to get out this side of the video. Should we? I've got some gel. Oh my goodness, that muffin was. I needed Tell it. Tell us your best, your favourite Christmas tradition. Put me tree up. That's 100%. standard. It's not standard, that's my favourite thing. <coughs> The only thing that will be missed this year is Bella won't be there to drink the water out the bottom of the tree. Oh yeah, which well, that was our thing that she loved to do. Hmm. Mine's so lovely. Let me just spill this out. Yeah, where are you going to do it in the trees? No, on the floor. That no, bad. Do it in the trees. Is it not like, oh, there's a drain? One sec, BRB. Well, that was really nice, but I wish, wish, wish she took us to the eye being paid. Okay, the latte needed a stir. Mm. Right, that's it. Maybe the latte got poured out. <laughs> and it actually needed a stir because when I've just excuse me tipped it out there was loads of like chocolate syrup at the bottom which was obviously the Toblerone bit oh well I've just stirred that and it's more chocolate you know um, Terry's orangey yeah because all the syrup must have gone to the bottom mm -hmm. well there we go stir your latte is the answer okay, a but we didn't have a stirring there. situation I could have used a pen but <laughs> it probably wasn't the best thing but yeah stir your latte and I think it might be nicer because on taste, I would only give that like a seven. But I think if it was stirred, it would be much nicer. Lovely. But there we go. There we have it. Trying the Costa Christmas menu. I really hope you've enjoyed this video. Let me know any other Christmas videos or Christmas content that you want to see. And thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to the channel. And of course, I will see you in my next video. Bye. Um. What's your favourite tradition you didn't say? You never asked me.